All right, this is the next video now. This, be careful where I move that, is the replacement those texts sent. Send the email, let them know the problem I was having with the previous one, which hopefully I won't have with this one. Because if I have the problem again, I want my money. The previous ones, they were not so much disconnecting. They connected fine. They played back music like they're supposed to, but the playback was very choppy, extremely choppy. And what I do is I walk into stores with my headset on and with my phone and I'm listening to music while I'm shopping and you know, then when I go to cashier I pause and then I'll resume playback. Sometimes during playback or during resuming, the previous ones would play back the music and then just chop, chop, choppy, 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 choppy. Like it's having a problem connecting with the phone or something and there is no amount of turning it off, turning it back on, it just does it. So hopefully these won't do that. They look like a refurbished box. <laughs> it looks like this was a, someone didn't like it and just brought these back. Okay, careful box. Oh man, that box is just all kinds of shit. I was hoping something else came today, but I don't know. So here they are. Why are these so dirty? Why couldn't people keep them clean? Dang, look at that. Look how dirty they are. they will work. <laughs> Alright, so I'm gonna put some alcohol up to these. Uh, before going further, the fisheye lens had multiple parts. So they got this inside part here, and then also this part. So. We'll see just how this part looks. Oh wow, so one part of the fish eye goes closer so I can do macro with this part, that's cool. Okay, so more playing around. The top part of it, this part, I can take that off and then put this back on there. Now this part's not hanging off it and it won't make noise, so let's... Yeah, that makes a big difference. So now it's not a humongous thing on the edge and I can see more on the outside. That's cool. You don't need to see that though. Yeah, ghost tech. So next time you send headphone replacements, make sure you you wipe them with some alcohol or something because these were embarrassingly dirty for a replacement pair. Fortunately, they cleaned up real nice. Look at that. They work absolutely fine. Except that little, little scratch there. I'm only being picky because mine shouldn't have any scratches on, but we'll find out because I got to pair these with those and show you what they were doing. It will recreate it too. It's it's real easy to reproduce. Uh, it came with that on the inside of the, the thing. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this in. Doing all this extra stuff, and I need to finish watching JoJo. Let me aim y'all just right. Okay, perfect. That doesn't help, but do it anyway, huh? Yeah, there we go. Taking that one out. One thing about these things, I always put tape on it so that they don't slip out. All right, and let's see. I want the 3.0 side for my phone. That's upside down technically. Well, they wrote anchor on this side, but then if you stick it in this way and see anchor that way, all the IQ stuff and all that information is upside down. You see that? So this, this would be right side up technically, but then this would be best, then you can see anchor on the side like that. So I'm gonna just stick it in this way. All right, seems like it's in there good. Let me flip that real quick. It's kind of tight. There we go. Yeah, you can't really see it because it's dark, but it's in there. I'll take a picture later, and then you'll see it. They sent everything, but of course the bag. So I guess that the bag's worth something, but those wires and stuff aren't worth that much. Anyway, I have the old and the replacement. I'm not gonna call it new because it's not. So let me unplug my phone real quick. Oh, let me show you something real quick before I. Get into that HTC M9. This is the first HTC 10 I bought. Can you, can you read that from there? Can you? They're both running Android 9. All right, enough of that. This one's not. This one's running 8.1.0. So let's go into Bluetooth. I haven't turned on the Rapture. Well, I'm listening to my own music, so you can hear the, the problem. Let me. Let me. No, that, that's the wrong box. 
I'm gonna use this one last time, uh, this thing. I'm gonna give that to someone, or maybe a giveaway. I don't know, but let's, let's, let's do this real quick. All right, so phone's here, my bag's there. This is the first one I bought, the replacement. I haven't switched them or anything silly like that. So I'm gonna just turn these on. And you can hear, because it, it's close. So hopefully it'll do the thing. It didn't have to rotate, why, why, why did you rotate? Whatever. All right, you hear that? That's what it does. Stutter playback. And it always does this. It doesn't matter if I'm walking into a store or just walking out or whatever. It, it does that. And then it'll do regular playback afterward. And it did it on this phone and the previous phone. But as you can see, it'll start playing back normally, but a pause. So now I'm talking to the cashier. Have a great day. There it is. And you see how close it is right now. There's no reason it should be doing that. Alright, so enough of that. Battery life on these, pretty good. As you can see, it's not even halfway and I haven't charged these for months. And I go into the grocery stores and stuff once a week. And so I'm in there for at least 10 minutes. So these do really good. I wonder what sort of noises y'all hear right now. Cause the mic's down there and I'm shaking stuff. Anyway, did I turn this? Yeah, I didn't turn this off, so I'm gonna turn these off. All right, so enough of that. Let's do, okay, we gotta do this first. I need to rename the other raptures to something else. Uh, no, no, cancel, that's not what I'm doing because that's one thing I don't like about touchscreen things. When you go to touch something, then the keyboard pops up, everything moves. And I'm like, why can't it just be up here? And then always designate keyboard space in some way. Anyway, let me rename this Rapture Degenerate. There you go. That'll work. This is why I like custom ROMs. I have to finagle with the, the cursor. All right, so that's the Rapture Degenerate. Let's pair a new device. Well, first we gotta set this up. Got about the same battery life. Okay, I assume that's it. Seventy percent battery. So I hope they confirm whether this works or not on this particular device. Oh, let me. Why did it do that? Power ramp, please. Why? See, that was convenient because I didn't have to do my password just then. And so I can just keep rolling. Right. You do see my uh, private devices, though. Alright. What's the fancy? I wish they could have taken the hardware out of that one, put the hardware from this one and that one, then I'll have that one. Because those I kept really nice. This one has a scratch here. Scratch down there. People don't know how to take care of stuff. What the heck? A little something in there. Find out these really work 
when I go in the store tomorrow. So, I'll go ahead and fold these up. Oh, before that, I want to do something. All right, so these are on. That's doing that. What happens when you press this button? I guess I need this button too. Cool. Press them both at the, the exact same time and you hear Rapture connecting on both devices at the same time. So now I'm playing this one. Come on, you listen. Oh well. I don't know how to do it. They do send a bag. I'm gonna keep the bag, okay? Guys, I'm gonna keep this bag. I can put something else in there, you know. I'm just gonna keep that. Y'all didn't have to send the bag. I, the bags weren't messed up. The wires weren't just uh, this headset. And this one's the replacement. Speaking of, let me get you nice and close. We can see all the scratches and stuff. Alright, so we got one scratch there. You see it? Boom. Alright, we got a scratch over here. A little too close, you see it? I think that was it. Just those two scratches. Oh, there's one here. up right there and those are the only mistakes on these let's compare old bag to use again the new replacement the replacement new they're not new all right <clears throat> let me show you how i keep keep my things when i buy them and they're brand new see see any scratches down there none no scratches flip this see all that flawless see any dirt do you see any dirt no inside Flawless. Hitting the, the box against that. All right. Let me look at the sides, cause this is the the place where I usually scratch that. Did I scratch that part right there? Look at that. Did I? You can't. You can't even see it on the camera. Yeah, like right there, right above my nail. Yeah. There's nothing there. And this side looks good too, except fingerprint marks. Right, yeah. So I take care of my things. All right. I'm gonna. I'm filling it up like it's not going right here. All right, I'm going to put this here. Put the weird things as far up as possible. Um, right side up. So it's going to be I should have tried the uh, thing. I'm not sending this to tomorrow, so maybe I'll read how to do it and then I'll do that. But I don't know, maybe it's in here. Maybe it'll explain it real easy. Number four, <clears throat> get social. Use the share me function to share your vibes. What does that mean? What does that even mean? I don't want to share vibes. I mean, that doesn't make sense. The word vibe in that sentence. Well, it means no, no, no. Vibes. Or an instrument. That's what they are. Anyway, let me go. All right, I do need to eat, and I want to watch JoJo and other stuff, and then go to sleep. But I really am curious. Uh, like, I just did the Duck Go search. I probably should the Google search, but I don't feel like there's any more energy. I want to connect the ones they sent me with this this feature. I just want to hear it, see if it works. Maybe these won't work with it because they needed to be replaced in the first place. But let's. I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try it. All I did so far different than before was I disconnected these entirely from the phone. So now when I connect these, it'll just connect to the phone like it's supposed to. So that's connecting like it does. So now I'm gonna turn these on. All right, pairing Rapture with device, then press both of these at the same time. Now, so 
now they should be connected to both. Let me go back to the music again. Yeah, all right, so that's how you do it. There's a little delay, but it's working. So does the volume go up together? Yeah, so you can hear the delay, but you can still share the music. So that means you wouldn't be able to jam with the person because they'd be like a whole count behind. So it'd be kind of weird. This might be good for like, maybe for watching like a video. Maybe. But then there'd be a delay. But you could at least somewhat enjoy the content. You'd just be surprised before this person gets surprised. <laughs> Alright, so... Oh, interesting. So, I paused this side. The music didn't stop. So now it's going over here. So, I guess if I pause the master side and not the uh, not master side... I'm being funny, basically. Okay, so this one will pause both of them, but this one will only pause itself. Cool. It seems to be doing the thing. But like I said, I'll find out when I go to the store tomorrow. Well, Let's be preemptive. If this does the same thing this does, what's a good replacement? I want, I don't want the cost that much more than this. I don't want sound isolation because these are just for walking into the store, walking out. I want it to be, you know, a nice, comfortable, just put it on, take it off, put it on, take it off. I don't need it to be, you know, sound isolating, and I also don't want it to go inside my ear because I'm trying to avoid those outside of blocking sound. Because apparently it's not good for your ears to have it go inside the ear like that. And I like to turn music up just a little loud, you know. Anyway, let me know. Oh, wait. Let me turn these off. Alright. So, basically, it's just like pairing those not quite true wireless headsets. I say not quite because they're not all, some of them aren't Bluetooth 5.0, which is the one that allows the true sending it in stereo from the device to the two things. So this one's just going from here and then it's sending its signal over here. It has nothing to do with the phone, which is Bluetooth 4.1 and down. So yeah, it's just like that.